Alright, so this one says the height of a parallelogram is three times its base. If the area of a parallelogram is 972 square inches, find its base and height. So um, we know we're talking about a parallelogram. It's probably going to look something like this. Right? Yes? No? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So now it says the height of the parallelogram is equal to three times the base. Now we don't know what the base is, right? But if I was going to say something three times the base, could I write in 3b is equal to h? Would that make sense? So I can say height is equal to 3b. That would not be three times the base. Um, so 3b, 3 times b would be, um, would be erasing it to the r, 3 times its base. And then it says that the area of the parallelogram is 972. So we're talking about area. So we need to remember area of the parallelogram. Area equals base times height. Well, we know what the base is. And then they say the height is 3 times the base. So therefore, I know the area, which is 972, equals base times h, we said is 3 times the base. So we can write this in as 3b. OK? AJ, do you see that? Does that make sense? Yeah. Does, anybody under, does everybody understand why and how I did that? I did that. What number are you? Oh, number eight. Question number eight. So now I can go ahead and multiply B times 3B, which is 972, equals 3B squared. So now to solve for this, I'll divide by 3. So then 972 divided by um, 972 divided by 3, I should be able to do this in my head, which I know it goes into. I just can't think right now. 124. So 124 equals b squared. Square root, square root. Uh, we're not going to be able to take the exact square root of this, but let's go ahead and approximate. Um, oh, I typed it in wrong. You're right. 972 divided by 3. Obviously, that doesn't make sense, which would be 324. Good job. And then the square root of second answer is 18.